G'day guys, this is Vice from the Future. Pretty much throughout this whole video, my microphone settings were completely stuffed. My microphone peaks a lot throughout the video. I'm very sorry. It gets it gets better towards the end of the video, but still, there's a lot of the video that is annoying. I'm getting a new microphone soon. It's going to be a really, really good one, like top of the line. This will never happen again, so I'm sorry for it happening now. But that's just that's just what it is. I'm an idiot. I didn't I didn't check my mic settings before I started recording. So yeah. But enjoy the rest of the video, because I know you will. It's, it's a great one. It is. It's a good one. G'day guys, Vice here. I'm back on my uh my world my world here. Uh my my little my little cave world here. Um so in the last episode it, it, this place didn't look like this, did it? I've done some I've done some decorating. I've changed up some things. First first thing that's changed is I've I've added I've added some gravel in the floor. Uh, I added some holes in the wall. I also added this thing. This isn't permanent. I just needed these things. Um, but added that. Also added it in this corner here. Um, added some holes in the floor. Added this cool little pattern around the crafting table. Vines and stuff. Uh, I also added some s s a cool feature in the enchantment room here, which is which is lovely. Got some gravel in here too, just to, you know, around there. But mainly the thing in the ceiling is quite cool, with the lantern hanging there. Also got some barrels uh, to hold the lapis, and I just added this one to be symmetrical. Um, I think that's all that's changed. Some more holes, some more vines. Also got like a chandelier thing going on here, which is quite cool. Oh, and added these these pillars on both sides. So now it's looking... it's got a lot more detail now, which is lovely. Uh, but I think I'm going to... I don't think I'm going to work on this base uh, much anymore. Apart from maybe this room. I might, I don't know what I'm going to do here. Might do something in this room, uh, in this episode. Uh, but yeah, now, quickly, I want to do those baby cows have grown up, so I'm going to quickly do... What? What the hell? Okay. Is it a barrel? What? Gift. And a bell? What? I mean, I'll take an emerald. And a bell. <laughs> okay, well, that's awesome. Um, cool. I mean, yeah, I was needing an upgrade. So that's useful. Hell yeah, I'll take some diamond armor. Um, uh, yeah, that's interesting. I don't know what the bell is about. Or who it's from. Anyway, that's cool. I'll also take this barrel, free barrel, you know what I mean? That's very odd. But I'll accept the gift. Thank you. Okay. Well, I mean, we have 34 levels. We could probably do some enchanting on that now. Look at these guys. Look how annoying. Like, they just rock up. I don't have villagers. Go away. Like, go away. Stop looking at me. I've done nothing wrong. Well, that scared me. I didn't know what that was. Okay. Going to bed. So, instead of uh, working on this diamond gear, I'm actually going to go exploring, because those pillagers gave me idea an idea. Pretty sure they're still here. Yeah. Hi. Hi, guys. Uh, I'm going to go search for a village. I know there's a huge plains biome over there. Hopefully, there's a uh, village there. I don't actually know if it's a huge plains biome. I'm just I kind of just saying that in hopes that it's a huge plains biome. But, yeah, it's just over here. Because, if we can find villagers, we can get mending books, and, ooh, that would be nice. Whoa. Nope. 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 A village. Do you see that? Do you see that roof over there? Oh, yes. There's a village. And it's close as. Well, I mean, it's... it's, a, it's I'm happy with how close it is. Okay, it's... You know, link another portal up. Bing, bang. No worries. Alright. But let's see. Does it have good stuff? It's huge. No, it's not. It's average size. 
Okay, I'm happy with this. Hey fellas, how are we? But yeah, I gotta get at least two of these villages back to the house. Probably not right now, but at least I know where this place is. Um, so, yep, once I get those two at the house, I can breed them pretty much. I guess is what you'd call it. Oh, hey buddy, got any good books? That's, you know, that's almost good. But it's just not quite good enough. Especially because there's 26 emeralds. Are you mad? Uh, and then also, once you get a villager breeder going on, you can, get, you can get these guys. Yep. And then you you, you drop them down into lava. No, look, look at me when I speak. You drop them down into lava and they die and you get the iron. Yep. Yep. That's your fate. That's all you're good for. Let's see what else you have in here. Nothing? Useless. Useless. Absolutely useless. Feather falling garbage. Can I can I get a many book straight up? Real quick, buddy? Just come here. Nope. Multi shot. No thingy. No. Ah, oh, get back. Nope. Well, that is quite good. Nah. <laughs> but your prices are too expensive, bro. Yeah, that's what I want. Mend it. Oh, yonks. Oh, yonks. 36 emeralds are you bro are you mad look it's okay I I understand the hustle man I was there once too you know anyway we need paper I want to lock his trades in because you're useful my man um I know where we can find paper I don't know where we can find 36 emeralds though it's all right. I forgive you. Let's go home. If I remember my way home, I, th I believe it's this way. Oh, they have two bells. Oh, that's illegal. I'm taking one. Thank you. Oh, look at all this paper. All right, where are you, buddy? Here he is. Okay. Look. Have I got the deal of a lifetime for you, alright? Boom. Paper. But let me let me let me chuck all that paper. Okay. You can't do that apparently, that's fine. I'm not uh You know what, let me just yeah. Refresh your trade. Let's see if there's anything better we can trade you for. Oh, 34 emeralds. Instead of, instead of 20, 26. Bane of Arthropod. Mate, you are really the worst, aren't you? I don't believe we're going to get enough. You suck. Alright, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go find one of your buddies and trade with him. Okay. Cause, well, what the hell are you guys doing? You good? Yeah, my, you know, I'll leave you to it. Is anyone looking for wheat? Cause I've got a lot of it. Anyone? No. Anyone? I think you got to put like a composter in front of them, and they turn into a. Did they turn into one of those things? I think, anyway, I ain't sure. Is there a free villager around that isn't occupied? Anyone? Did I already look in here? Oi! You guys doing your own little trade, I see. Okay, good, good. Ooh, 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 not quite. 
No, no, we want the wheat trade, my friend. The wheat one. <sighs> That's what I'm talking about. What can we get it cheaper? Oh no, I'm so greedy. Should have just gone with that one. Yep, that'll do. Stay there, don't go anywhere. Don't look at me like that. Okay. Hey, I found some wheat. Here you go. Oh, 30. Mmm, 33. Ooh. Come on. 34. That's exactly how many we needed, yo. Pleasure doing... Wait, we got more here. So, my bad. Well, it was a pleasure doing business with you, my friend. Uh, I'll be back. For more. Oh, what we got here? Or any potatoes anyway? No, I'm just kidding. We're done here. Um, so now you've changed it to 33. That's good. It's very good. I like to hit like yes, very good. Boom. I've got a mending book, boys. Okay, even with your trash prices, I've got a mending book. Okay, I'll be back. I'll be back for you. A zombie's gonna come and infect you one day. I'm going to save you. And then you give me it cheaper. Deal? Deal. I almost forgot to put the mending on my pickaxe. That would have been funny. Look at that. Absolute stacked pickaxe right there. Boom. Oh yeah, I need efficiency 5, don't I? For it to be like amazing. amazing. Still good. How many bells we got? A 1, a 2, a 3. Oops. Keep those separated, because one of them's, I don't know, probably cursed or something, so. Alrighty, so I've made a little decision. Uh, pretty much, this and this are pretty terrible. These are also not great, but they are protection 4, so I'm uh, ha happy with that for now. Would like I'm breaking, but anyway. Uh, but anyway, these are garbage, so. Yep, we need protection 4 on that, and protection 4 on that. Uh, and then I'll be happy. However, we can't re enchant these, unless we put it in like a grinder or, or something but I'm happy with the enchants we've already got on them so what I'm gonna do is make new ones and then pretty much c combine them together to make the best armor possible unfortunately we weren't given any spare with the free with the free stuff we got so we've got to use our own diamonds unbelievable but let's see what we can get on these so that's already looking amazing and that isn't so we're gonna go with the boots first and we can check the boots on there. So, yeah. Uh, though I need more levels. So, let's do that. Mm, yeah, okay. So, I've got a bunch of... A uh, bunch more. In the quartz. Which is lovely. Uh, boots, I think I wanted to enchant. I've got 35 levels, which means we can do a lot of... Uh, a lot of enchants. Like, two or something. Come on. Are you serious? <laughs> I already have depth strider on those ones. <laughs> anyway. Okay, try the sword. Yes, that's what we want. That's actually really hard to find, so I'm glad. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, so from now on, the microphone should be a okay, because I am smart and I changed my settings. Anyway. So, now the armor is looking absolutely fantastic. I didn't show all of it because I just I wanted to get rid of the clips that had the really bad microphone, so I'm sorry about that. But anyway, he saw majority of it. Um, and, you know, we've got this amazing pickaxe as well with the mending on it. And I also managed to get a Silk Touch pickaxe, which is, uh, which is awesome. So it, um, yeah, the, the hint was a Silk Touch. So I got it, and it came with Efficiency 4 and Unbreaking 3, which is a legendary... Okay, so, for the next part of this video, I think I want, because we've, you know, we got that villager with the mending trade and everything, I think I want to build a little, little village over here. Pretty much transport the villagers over here and so on. Um, but, I'm going to do it in a very, very fancy, very fancy style. 
I'm going to build a village. Here, right here. But obviously I'm going to need to do some fixing up of the land. Um, I've made myself a very nice shovel. So we'll be able to tear through this immensely fast. And we'll be able to patch up this. So just got to get swinging. Yeah, alright. So this is roughly how big... This, I mean, it's going to be a small village because... You know, I'm sure you've seen big, you know, enormous villager systems, but uh, I don't need something crazy because I'm only going to have a couple villages here. So, um, but yeah, just something to something to look nice. So, yeah, I suppose I'm going to start with the first house. I'm really just going to wing it. I have no, not no idea, but I have I don't have much of an idea of what I'm going to do. But, but yeah, we'll see. I still got to gather some resources. Go, you know, cut some trees down and stuff. But yeah. Alright guys, so I'm going to try to do a bit of a different style of time lapse here. I'm just going to give a little commentary. So, I didn't really know what I was doing at the start of this build. I was kind of, like I said, winging it. Um, but I think it turned out pretty well in the end. Uh, I've decided to add a little bit of a basement sort of thing I suppose you can call it underneath even though the villagers can't access it it was kind of just like a little detail might be able to chuck some things in there so that's why it's raised up a little bit um, also I've never done a style like this build before so you've seen me doing a bunch of trial and error pretty much just seeing what I think looks good and a lot of it doesn't so I tear it down and uh, and redo it as you can see uh, now I'm trying a bunch of things that uh, really aren't working now try for a really big window but then end up switching it uh, just to the two two windows, yeah, right now. So I'm trying to add a lot of detail with these trapdoors. I end up adding a lot of trapdoors into this build, as you guys will see when it's finished. But yeah, I, di <laughs> I didn't really know what else to add for detail. So and now I'm just working out the back there because I've added a bit of a yard there which I didn't move the camera around too much so you can't really see but you'll see that in the end also I didn't show much of the other side working on the door here I didn't didn't know what I was going to do for the door so I was just did something really simple and the, the roof as well yeah that wasn't <laughs> I had some trouble with that uh, especially because well there's a lot of detail in the build itself, but only one texture for the roof. So it was a bit, it looked out of place, but I think it looked all right there in the end. I actually tried another design before this, but I didn't end up showing it because it was just kind of like a waste of time in the video. I really like that feature I added on the roof there, that little, uh, little window thing. So there's actually gonna be two stories to the house, which hopefully the villagers will be able to walk through, uh, make it accessible. And here I'm extending the roof out to the uh, front deck area, I suppose. Um, because before, yeah, it wasn't covered, it didn't look right. But now I've covered it and it, that really helped with the roof. So I'm glad I did that. If you guys have any tips or, or anything that could help me in the build, that'd be fantastic. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I think I, I had a chimney in here now, just out the back, which looked really nice. But then this happened. Something horrible has happened. Um, oh no. Oh, this is not good. Wow. Okay, okay, I have no idea why that happened, and I guess pff, there's no other way to find out whether it's an issue or not, unless I log back on. Oh boy, okay. Well, that's not good. Oh, jeez. 
I mean, everything is so messed up. Every chunk, something wrong has happened to it. What the hell happened? What the hell happened? My base is gone. My cows are leaving. What? Okay, guys. Huh. Who knows why that happened? I certainly don't. However, there's no fix. My builds are gone, essentially, which is fantastic. Uh, especially because I literally just finished that build, got onto the world to record and say, hey, look, I finished the build, look how amazing it is. Uh, it then just did that, that uh, chunk error thing. So, what I have to do, go on, make a new world with the same seed, go to that location, and rebuild. I'm going to grab all the necessary items that I had just out of creative. Um, because obviously I can't, I'm not going to rebuild that in survival, that's just stupid. Um, but obviously it's not going to be the same. You know, the villager I found earlier, uh, not going to have, you know, it's going to take a while, I've got to get that trade back. Um, yeah, things like that. i got to chuck in my cow farm again. My sugar cane farm. Well, yeah, everything. So, I'm going to do that. I'm not going to record it. I'm just going to be back when it's all there. It's going to take a long time and I probably won't get it done today. <sighs> Look at it. Look at it. So empty. Well, full. Full of stone. <sighs> and, yep, everything. Everything's gone. The build I just did. Honestly, that hurts a lot. My cows are gone. My wheat's gone. My sugar cane farm's gone. <sighs> well, time to rebuild, I suppose. So, yes. I will try not to add anything by mistake, but those things happen. So, yep. Anyway, I'll catch you when it's done, I guess. Ah, <sighs> okay. Much better. I have successfully rebuilt everything. Uh, like, everything. Uh, well, actually, not everything. I didn't do this room only because I knew I was actually going to rip it out. I forgot that. Yeah, I knew I was going to rip that out, so I didn't, uh, didn't rebuild that. But anyway, yeah, it took me a while. It's taken me about an uh, hour to two hours. But everything is back where it should be. Um, yeah, that's... Yep, I obviously haven't stocked all the chests as much as they were, but I put the most important things in and just, you know, a certain amount of dirt, a certain amount of cobble sort of thing. Um, and, yeah, I got my, got my, oh, actually, I haven't put my sugarcane farm in, I'll, uh, I guess I'll do that, I've just got to give myself some sugarcane and I'll just fix that up. Uh, but anyway, I got my cow farm back, uh, roughly the same amount of cows, there were a lot of cows here, so, I think this is the right amount. Uh, and then the, the wheat farm, um, and then over here. Had to rebuild this house, but obviously I knew what I was kind of going for, so um, remaking it wasn't too difficult. But here it is. I think it looks. I think it looks awesome. I haven't done a lot of like technical builds, yeah, really ever. So this this is really really this is really fun to make, and up until it disappeared on me. But yeah, this this is this was fun. Um, inside there's yeah nothing at the moment, uh, apart from a little little fireplace. I mean, it's a campfire in the fireplace. I'm probably going to change that out. And still need to put some glass panes in here. And make a second, like a second floor thing. Probably just with like a ladder going up to it, honestly. And then you've got a little backyard thing. I think it's awesome. I love it. Um, and obviously I've got to add some, you know, greenery stuff. You know, like a little farm or whatever. Anyway, I'm going to build another one bit different, similar, very similar, but bit different uh, over here, and then maybe another one over here, and then we can start moving in some villages. Alright guys, so I'm going to end this episode here, I've had it with this episode, it's been too crazy, uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed it, if you did, make sure to like, like the video, subscribe, and uh, comment, I love reading your comments, I love replying to them, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one, see ya!